Hey, it's me, Markel's, Markel's World, all things professional wrestling in my life. If you're on YouTube, sub to the YouTube channel. If you're on TikTok, follow me on TikTok. Roman Reigns, two belts is not enough for him. Two belts is not enough for him. We, I don't even know, but I don't even know. We are in for a treat. We are in for a treat because um, Roman Reigns and Solo Sokola is going to challenge for the belts at Night of Champions. I don't see Roman Reigns losing a match because he has been undefeated, what, for two years almost? So I don't see him losing a match, and it's a tag team match. I, I see him losing that match that's major and is more meaningful. So I don't see him losing that, fa you know, that big win streak just for a Knight of Champions tag team match. So, um... This sucks for the for um, Sammy and Kevin if this is really the end of their reign because it didn't last that long. I am hoping that they somehow do win, but I don't know if they're really gonna if they're willing to make Roman Reigns lose his streak of being undefeated. I don't I don't see that happening, but um, I will say if they win, that's just gonna. I have no idea how people are going to react. Some people are going to love it. Yeah, people that love the storytelling and, and they're the true wrestling fanatics and they love the storytelling. They love the not, the winning streaks. They love the records. This is something for them if they're really old school and it's all about the wins and losses. So it's good for them, for the old school, you know, wrestling fans that really love wrestling, you know, but there's a lot of people that love wrestling in their own different ways, such as the records, such as the entrances. I know a lot of people that just watch wrestling for all the entrances. Some people watch it for the wrestling, such as the wrestling moves, but they don't, you know, the wrestling moves and how to be a better wrestler themselves because they're trying to make it. Some people watch it because they love watching professional wrestling. Some people watch it because they like betting in the records. So I don't even know what a true wrestling fan is at this point, but, um. This, I don't even know. If they really lose the tag team championships that fast, what was the point? I'm sorry. What was the point? Why would you even give me a title if I can't even hold it for two, what, three months? What was the point? I mean, it's a short reign, but okay. I guess we had our WrestleMania moment, but still, I wouldn't, I, I, I would want something that's longer, more meaningful, and had title defenses against more than just the same team back and forth. This is stupid. So um, I really hope that's not the end of the reign. But this is WWE. I will be surprised if WWE makes Roman Reigns lose, but I don't see that happening. This is Mark Hill's World. I think professional wrestling in my life. We do love to gossip here. Do you think that Roman Reigns is going to have his first loss with this Knight of Champions title match? Do you really think that's going to be where he loses? Do you think they're going to make him lose and have the excuse that he hasn't lost a single match? Single match. And then they're going to continue the reign. And that's how they keep the reign going. But they don't make um, Kevin and Sammy reign stop. That's a possibility. Hey, we're not going to make them lose their reign that fast, but Roman, you're really not undefeated no more in WWE, but you are undefeated in one-on-one -on -one matches. So no one can say that they beat you one-on-one -on -one and you've been undefeated for one-on-one -on -one matches. I guess you'll have that reign. Is that a reign in the worker books? I don't think that is. I think it's the longest reign of matches at all, even including battle royals and things like that. You have the longest reigning. So, who knows? Who knows? Who knows? I'm really trying to think about something, honestly, to even talk about because it's just like it, it's kind of predictable that they're not going to make Roman Reigns lose. So, it just ain't even making me want to get excited, which is kind of sad. So, Hopefully WWE does something different. That would shock me. That will make my night. That actually will make my night, seriously. And I was okay, that was one of the better pay-per-views. It wasn't as predictable, but if 
he doesn't if he does win the belts and this is how they're trying to push solo to be the future generation star does make sense since the usos they're not old but they're not you know they're closer to 40 than they're 30 at this rate so i do sometimes there are reports that they're thinking about train just being trainers soon and roman reigns that's why he's part-time he's thinking about doing that part-time then eventually just together stop and do the little hollywood you know career where you don't really have to travel that much you can work for three months on a movie be done promote take three months off do another movie promote you know something like that their schedule is not as bad but yeah you better enjoy the usos and roman while they're still here in wrestling on a weekly basis i mean i guess roman Reigns doesn't show up every week but we do see him at least twice a month i, I feel like we see him every other week but Mark Hell's World, all things professional rest of my life. Follow me on TikTok. Subscribe to the YouTube. Comment if you really think that they're going to... Comment if you think they're going to make him lose his reign, Roman Reigns. Or comment if you think that they're going to make him win the title. And the same and Kevin Owens win. WrestleMania win was just really a moment because their reign wasn't that long. Comment if you like. Please like. See you guys next time.